So in this video, I'm going to be showing you what's in this wondrous backpack because, you know, I'm a college student, so I want you guys to know what I carry around to class and things like that, whether it be textbooks, my laptop, stuff like that. And I also have a job, and it's not a campus job. I also have a campus job, but I have a regular job too. So I just want to show you how I carry a lot of things around and all that. So let me show you what's in my bag. Okay, so let's start on the outside of my bag. This is a plushie bag from Hot Topic. I got it uh, a year or two ago for high school, but since they changed the rules and we couldn't carry our backpacks around, it was kind of no point. So this is still a pretty sturdy bag. Uh, I usually switch around with bags. Like I have my dance bag that I usually carry at carry my work stuff in most of the time or I have my Sailor Moon bag which is also from Hot Topic and I'll link those down in the description box if you guys want to check them out let me show them to you real quick okay first it's my Sailor Moon bag from Hot Topic it has this bow here I bought this a year ago after I well technically yeah it was last year after I graduated and I had some graduation money I just got a new bag for college so yeah it flaps over like this and then it opens up and it's white and blue and red and it's nothing really special here. But yeah, that's my Sailor Moon bag. And then my dance bag. And then my dance bag is this right here. It's an, it's an Under Armour bag, yes. And I have this little CUA Cares thing right here. And then I have my name tag so we know whose bag is who's on the dance team because we all kind of have the same bag. So yeah, that's my Under Armour bag. I will link in a, a one that's similar to this one, but I don't think you're going to be able to get the exact one because it has, you know, our gear on it and stuff like that. But let's get on to actually showing you what's in my actual bag. Okay. So back to the plushie bag, on the outside, I want to show you, I have this clip thing right here. I have this clip thing right here that says Team Jesus. It's kind of an inside joke with the dance team that we have. I don't feel like it really explaining, but yeah, I have a Team Jesus bracelet there. And I just clip it around here like this. And I also have this Harry Potter keychain that I attach to every backpack that I switch to. And I got it as a Christmas gift from my friend Cordell. And uh, I think it's from Walgreens. So I could maybe link this into the description box. If I can, I will. So yeah, let's get into the bag. So you first open my bag. First thing you see is this here. I bought this. Um, from Forever 21 like five years ago so it's a little eroded but this is where I carry all of my colorful highlighters and pens when I am um, decorating my notes or my bullet journal so nothing really special here and these pens let me tell you guys the brand it's midliner and I'll link those into the description box too I think the brand is Zebra, Zebra Midliner, yes. And that that's one thing that's in my bag. And the next thing, you'll see another bag here that I got from Wish, um, also for five years ago. And it's an EXO bag. I really like how the style of it looks. And I just have my regular pens and pencils in here. Um, I like to separate those two just so I won't have too much writing utensils in one baggy. And uh, the next thing in my bag is my wallet. My wallet has my cards in there. I don't want to show you that. And then in here, I just have like business cards and stuff like that. And if I have some cash, I have cash in here. But right now, everything's on my card. And yeah, and this wallet, 
I got from Marshalls a few years ago. It's a really big wallet. I think I need to invest in a smaller wallet. I'm gonna try to put a link to a similar wallet like this from Marshalls in the description box. But yeah, this wallet is my favorite. It's lasted me a good while. And I really like this wallet. So the next thing I have is my bullet journal. It is a minimalism art no, uh, journal and the lines are, let me show you a blank page because I filled this up to the brim. It is, they have dotted lines. Well, not even lines, they're just it's just dotted like a grid so you can just draw anything and that's kind of what I wanted my my skills aren't really that good but let me show you my most recent page in my bullet journal so yeah I kind of just with my terrible handwriting just put out the weeks and stuff like that and I write my objectives of what I'm gonna do and yeah kind of just things like that to keep me organized and I'll also show you my month chart. I'll show you March. And this is what it looks like here. I want to do something more small so I can have a uh, space and stuff like that in my next bullet journal for next um, school year. So I'll show you guys what that looks like in a back to school video, things like that. So yeah, that's my bullet journal. The next item I have is another minimalism art notebook. I kind of traced over this with a pen because I thought it looked kind of cool. But yeah, it's pretty simple. I put all my YouTube notes and uh, ideas and stuff like that in here. I pretty much just try to plan for YouTube videos daily and stuff like that. It also has dotted lines. And I'll show you a page for it. See here is, ooh, it's bright. Here is my 2020 YouTube plan. Um, I haven't really fully like got into this, and I also added more onto it, so it's a little different now. But yeah, I just write my plans out for the year, for the month, and for the next videos and stuff like that. I put video ideas down, kind of just things like that, just to keep myself organized. Um, video improvement notes, things like that, so I can stay on top of things. And the next items I have in my bag are my notebooks. Uh, these are the two that I'm using right now. Most of the time I type my notes, but right now I'm trying to get a rocket book, book soon. I'll probably order that one of these days. And yeah, so um, these are um, Muji notebooks, and I'll link those these also in the description box so you can get them if you want they're really nice so when you open them up they're all pretty plain and simple when you open them up it's just a regular line paper like this and i just like to write my notes in there to stay organized and so on stuff like that and the last item that i have in my bag frequently is my notebook here I just like doodle on it sometimes because I'm bored and inside I just have, I have my music for vocal lessons I have my folders here with my homework stuff for my acting class last semester but yeah I just have I put my assignments in here to keep myself organized things like that and yeah kind of just use this I don't use the binder as much but I keep it in my bag to stay organized another thing that I have in my bag quite a lot is my laptop it's a very I can't show it to you guys it's fine but it's a very old MacBook Pro and I kind of I'm getting a new one soon sooner or later so I can link a regular MacBook Pro or MacBook Air. I plan on getting a MacBook Air soon. So I can link one down in the description box if you want to get one and you don't know where to go, even though I'm sure everyone knows where to go to get that. I mean, it's the Apple Store. But yeah, I usually carry my laptop a lot too. And I also got this mouse on Amazon because sometimes I like to play games, not in class, 
but I like to play games in my room sometimes. So I got this mouse so it'd be easier to play the games because sometimes the MacBook controls are a little weird. But yeah, so I carry this mouse around a lot too. But that is all that is in my bag. Nothing really special or interesting. I just wanted to show you what I put in my bag for class and things like that. And that would be all for this video today. Thank you guys for watching this video. And if you like this video or any of the other videos on my channel, please subscribe if you haven't already. And like this video if you really liked hearing about my college life and things like that. Also guys, on a little side note, I would like to thank you for all the views I had for my recreating my first video. video. Um, I really, I think you guys really like those type of videos where I do hauls and stuff like that. So I'll try to do those more often, hopefully. So you guys look forward to that. I'm gonna try a lot of more yes style experiments or online fashion store experience experiments and stuff like that so look forward to that and i'll see you guys in the next video One, two, three.